ito na yata ang pinakamalakas na naramdaman mo ng lintor. Na sobrang lakas, hangin talaga ang pinaka sa akin. Mas malalakas yung nakikita natin ng mga tropical cyclones. Hi everyone! I am Perly Maricilia from the section BTLED HA1B. This video is my NSTP Performance Innovative Task number 2. Today, I have something important to share, especially in light of recent events. We all know how unpredictable disasters can be, so it's crucial to be prepared. As a NSTP student, I must know this kind of things. So in this vlog, I'll show you what's inside my bag during a disaster. Are you excited? Let's dive right in! But first, let me show you a short montage on what my bag looks like. First things first, I always have a sturdy waterproof bag. It is very essential to keep my belongings safe from water and other elements. Now, let's see what's inside. I brought some extra clothes with me. I have also an emergency blanket. It's compact, lightweight, and provides warmth during cold nights. It's a simple yet effective item to have in your bag. Reliable flashlight with spare batteries is a must. It's essential for navigating in the dark, especially if power goes out during a disaster. Communication is vital during emergencies. I keep a power bank and a portable phone charger to ensure my devices stay charged, allowing me to stay connected with my loved ones and access important information. I also bring with me my important files like my birth certificate and many more. It is very essential to bring it because we can use it in many things. Staying hydrated is key. I carry a refillable water bottle to ensure I have access to clean drinking water even if supplies are limited. I also pack a lightweight and non-perishable foods like canned goods and biscuits this provide quick energy and are easy to carry. I have some corned beef, some afritada, some sardines, and some tuna. I also have some biscuits, cup noodles, Safety is a top priority. I have a compact first aid kit containing band-aids, wipes, pain relievers, and any essential medications I or my family members might need. Let me show you what's inside my first aid kit. I have some medicines like myogesic for fever. I also have some um, loperamide and pain relievers. I also have some band-aids to treat wounds. I also have some cotton, alcohol, some ointments or efficacent, some gauze pad, Take a look at my second bag. 
hygiene is often overlooked in emergency situations. Staying clean can prevent illness and infections. Let me show you what's inside my hygiene kit. First, I have my wallet with my IDs inside and also money. Don't forget your money! I also have some toothbrush and a toothpaste. Some deodorant. Tissues. Some perfume. And also a comb. I also have some sanitary napkins, especially for a girl like me, that is very essential. Some body soap. Shampoo and conditioner for my hair. And laundry powder. Being prepared goes beyond having the right items. It's about knowledge and practice. Stay informed, attend local workshops, and involve your community. Together, we can build resilience and face any challenge that comes in our way. Thanks for watching, and remember, preparedness starts with you. That's all for my vlog. Take care!